your first alert weather with Chief Meteorologist Brad Travis. Never been on a cruise, but uh, it's on the bucket list. I want to do it one, one of these days. Love yeah. You're a cruise person, you're getting on. Or maybe when I retire. We're a long way from that. 53 degrees right now. Uh, not looking bad here. Looking at 565 in Huntsville from the U.S. Space and Rocket Center. Traffic's pretty good on the Breeze camera network. Current temperatures falling into the 40s up across southern middle Tennessee. Hanging on to the 50s under more cloud cover here in parts of North Alabama. Huntsville, a Albertville at 52, Huntsville 53. Here's the clouds. Satellite shows the clearing is going on back here to the west. Also a few spotty showers. Most of those probably sprinkles there in western Arkansas. It's not going to rain around here anytime soon. In fact, our next chance of rain is Monday night and definitely Tuesday. Looking at showers and thunderstorms. We'll have more on that in just a second. Tonight down to 42 on average. It'll be partly cloudy. It'll be chilly out there, but it's going to be a little colder and a threat for a light frost uh, tomorrow night into Friday morning. And again, watch for motorcycles. Watch for kids on bicycles the coming days. We've got a real nice stretch of weather. People are going to be getting things out for the first time this year in some cases. Also, watch out for boaters. If you could be out on area lakes, boaters getting out uh, as the season's getting uh, in, in gear, so to speak. 64 tomorrow, sunset at 7.05. Here's your Easter weekend forecast. We'll touch base on the Christmas weekend forecast later down the road. 78 degrees Saturday, 80 degrees Sunday. Beautiful weather, perfect weather to spend some family time outdoors. That mud in the backyards, maybe dealing with that the last few days. That should be drying out over the coming days with the dry air, the sunshine, rain chances pretty much zero until Monday night. That'll be at the earliest. You get out and mentioned earlier, wash that uh, Mach 1. It's going to have a lot of pollen on it too. Mine's been in storage for a while, so I'm sure the battery's probably dead. We'll get it out one of these days. But here's a look at the next weather maker. This is Tuesday. I'm pretty sure it's going to rain. We could see some stronger thunderstorms depending on how all this comes together. Keep in mind a lot of changes happen in a short period of time. This time of year we are in our severe weather season and April is pretty much the peak of that and this will be the beginning of April here uh, six o'clock in the evening Tuesday showers, thunderstorms, locally heavy rain, strong gusty winds. We're keeping an eye on this. If the trends continue, we'll put out a first alert for this tomorrow. If that data coming in overnight tonight throughout the day tomorrow. Uh, suggest that, but right now mm, it's getting close. As far as your forecast for the next 10 days, we're still looking at a cool down behind Tuesday. And then as we get on into uh, the Tuesday, Wednesday time frame, that's where we have showers and storms coming through. And Wednesday's high, maybe 59. We may have another frost. Hopefully, the last time we say the word frost, mm. that'll be next Thursday morning. So, a week from tomorrow, hopefully, that will be it. Keep